The following video is a recap of Fletchling Community Day. Welcome to Lewis's Adventures Place Pokemon Go. Me, Lewis Marinucci, as your host. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. In this video, we are going to cover Fletchling Community Day as well as catch as many shiny Fletchling as I can hopefully get. Plus, doing the timed and special research events that accompany this community day. In order to do the special research, you had to buy the ticket in the in-game store in order to unlock this special research quest. Today is the day. Stay tuned to see how many shiny fletchling I catch in this latest adventure of mine. Well, this community day really got off to a rough start. As you see here, I'm bored, annoyed, and frustrated because it took me a while until I got my first shiny Fletchling. But I still had fun doing the special research, which involved, for the first step, powering up a Pokemon 10 times, catch 15 Fletchling and making five nice throws. For the second part, I had to catch 15 Fletchling once again, plus transfer 10 Pokemon and evolve three Fletchling. For the third step, I had to make three great curveball throws, evolve one Fletchinder, and transfer 10 Pokemon once again. And then the fourth and final step, you automatically get those rewards after you, you click on them. But of course, hopefully the next community day will be much brighter and more fun and more relaxing. Enjoy the rest of this footage, everyone.
after an hour of searching, I finally got my first shiny fletchling. But due to technical difficulties, there's going to be some edits in this video. It won't be perfect, but I promise you, things will get better. Well, today wasn't a pretty good community day for me. Because of the fact there weren't too many shinies that spawned. Just pretty much poor shiny luck for me. But I managed to catch 13 shinies. Yes, my final shiny count is 13. Hopefully next month, the next community day will be much better. And of course, hopefully later this year, once things get better, I'll be able to go back outside to the Philadelphia Museum of Art and resume doing community day from there. In the meantime, this is Lewis saying, thanks for watching everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure. Also during these times when heading out, always wear a mask, wash your hands, carry hand sanitizer with you, practice social distancing, Stay six feet apart from others. Stay away from large crowds. Get vaccinated when it's your turn. And most importantly, stay safe and stay healthy. And together, we will get through these dark times together.